that's the feel I want on that left toe. Push me through the, like back, there you go, more. That way. Yeah. I think I could live in that world of 114, 115, 68, 69, 70 ball speed, carrying a 290. Thanks for watching everyone. Something really cool happened in our last Be Better Golf School. A PGA Tour pro came by and using Dr. Scott's help and the Swing Catalyst, he set his all-time ball speed record and his all-time club head speed record right there at the Grand during our golf school. So what's going on is on the left-hand side of your screen, that is Dr. Scott Lynn, who works with Swing Catalyst, which is the force plate you've seen and you'll see in this video. And on the right is Greg Chalmers. Greg is a PGA Tour winner and he is a guy that has arthritis in his back for a while and he's done a lot of work to make a big comeback, a lot of physical work to finally get strong enough where he's now actually swinging faster than ever. So he came to Scott and been talking with Scott about what he can do into the ground to get even more speed with almost not even trying harder. It's a weird thing, but you'll see more about it. And in the middle, that's Greg's performance coach, Neil Smith another guy from Australia that uh, really concentrates on what golfers can do to shoot better in tournaments. Another announcement, Scott just had a baby. So put congratulations to Scott down in the comments of this video. I didn't know really what to do with all this footage because it's a lot of footage of the process that Greg went through. So I'm just going to put it all up there and I'll part try to put some titles to make it make sense. Finally, if you're interested in joining us, we're going to be doing this again with Dr. Scott down at the Grand in late August of this year. So go to BeBetterGolf.net slash school. So here's the process of how Greg did it. So, so Scott, you're looking at how, how much percentage-wise he got into his trail slider yeah. in between those three. The last one was 81. The one before that was... 78, 79. Only 2%. Only 2% difference. Wow. The one where you wanted to get way right actually didn't. It was only 75. Or wait, sorry, into yeah, the trail into side. The trail side yeah. yeah. That was only 75. Interesting. Oh, I can get over there if you want. I'll go over there. Here we go. Okay. You ready? Yeah. feels so much more like could go wrong. Yeah, well it does. <laughs> That's correct. <laughs> yeah. Let me make a note of this. That's good. So that now give me like kind of one of those middle ones where you're trying to twist that left foot in the ground yep. and get to your like 81, 82 optimal pressure shift number. Oh, that was awesome. <laughs> Roger done numbers or real numbers? I mean, those are, those are, uh, that's legit. Normalized numbers, yeah. And yeah, these are, that's pretty close to a real ball. That's pretty nice. Yeah. The spin was done. I can see how, like, I feel like I'm going to, when I get on grass, I feel like I can get after it a little more. Yeah, yeah, totally. Is that yeah, 166? That, like, fear of falling up there. Yeah. What if he started a tiny bit more weight this way to start? Which but, but like on his rear foot? Yeah. But then felt that like, like the iron swing from there. Or is it, is it, or is it? Oh, you, see, you see people doing this kind of thing. You're talking about being back here, but then felt that. But, but then, well, I'm just wondering, like if there was, Rather than 50 50, maybe 60 40, but then felt like the iron swing from there. Yeah, you have a hair, a little bit of a kind of foot forward press. Because you go from 55 trail to 55 lead, and then the club moves away from the ball. Yeah. Um, I so do feel wanna... like at static, I'm bloated in my trail. Yeah. Um, I didn't know I'd do that. But... Yeah, which is fine. I don't mind that actually. Yeah. That little pre shot trigger. Mm -hmm. So effectively, that's a version of what you're talking about, right? Yeah. 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 High launch, low spin. But Greg, for shaping too, it's like the cues could be as simple as any time on the draw, feel it coming more this way. Yeah. Any time you want to cut it, feel stack and tilt. Yeah. <laughs> And for the bomber straight one, 
It's the it screw, the, screw the carpet. It's really hard to hook it yeah. when you stack onto that lead side holder. Yeah, but so you want something to start this way and peel off it? That's going to be a great cue for you. I yeah. think that's going to be really fun with the eyes. Yeah. Because I've always feared going over there yeah. with my eye control. If I had, you know, a nice feeling of, hey, just do this, and it shuts that out. Yeah. Like what? Could be what fun. is it? Six at Pebble? No, four. Four. Yeah. Six. Yeah, like I or would you aim. Can just feel like I'd be I'd love to be able to aim close to the middle of the green yeah. and just hit it. Yeah. You know, just to get my feel rather than aim left and <laughs> this. hope it doesn't go over there. <laughs> Don't do that. Club head, 298 carry, 68 ball, I think. Yep, 68 ball. 299 carry, I got over here. Yeah. And Greg, for like 20 years on your career, you're always around 109 or so. Club like, speed? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, about four years ago, I started trying to work out, get faster. Heard that part right. Now I'm trying to be efficient. Right. And get it through moving better. 118 is good. Yeah. Well, he said he never had 120 in his life. That would really be special no, I for him. Uh, just oh, okay. Once, <laughs> once, just one time. All right. That'd be fun. That'd be fun just to see a new number, yeah. to see a brand new yeah, Chalmers record right here. Yeah. Man, that's Dude, that's really good. So, how big of a difference for you is that six miles an hour club head? How big? Yeah. Oh, it's massive. That's, well, I've gone back to venues that we play every year yeah. that I couldn't carry bunkers or carry whatever, and I'm like, oh, now I can. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. That's been fun. Well, that one. That felt really good. <laughs> it wasn't the fastest one, but it just felt really good. Good turn on shot. See how I just broke your tea, I think. I can, <laughs> I can see how you could get like that's a sign we got to move up to the grass now. Okay, let's, yeah, let's grab the launch one right now. <laughs> felt laborious, felt much, much. I would uh, be careful with too much trail foot flare. Yeah. yeah. Because then you got to turn further before you can start twisting it in the ground. Yeah. Okay. The whole point is to kind of decelerate that backward rotation. With, yeah. So if that's a little square, it'll. You right stand of the bowl for that. Six to eight, probably three. That's the one. Yeah, we get freaking up me. Four eight smash. See what it is too. Because I think I could live in that world. No way that the angle attack is not right. I think when the sun shines directly into the quad, it can get some funky club Look at the path. Eight one. It's no way. No. But I think I could live in that world of 114, 115, 68, 69, 70 ball speed carrying a two nine. Yeah, but great thing about it, most guys are going to have three drives. Your stock, your fairway finder, and your bomber. bomber. Right, so you might only use the bomber a couple times a day. Wow, well, let's see you what know, the bomber but, is now. Yeah, and it depends on the week as the, the percentage ball. between the, yep. the three. Yep. Right? All nuts. And your competence at that, that yep. week, you know. Yep. Oh, it's close. Because you, if you're good using the bomber and you're not competent at it, we know what happens. I'm trying that That was better speed. That was better speed. So, yeah. interesting, you know. in somebody's backyard, but so, uh, yeah, <laughs> apart from that, it's fine. 118, <laughs> yeah. Let's set up to it. Now take it to the top. Okay, now, no, you want to shove me backwards. That's the feel I want off that left toe. 
push me through the, like back, there you go, more. That there, way? Yeah, there. You think, I, you think I get there you go. stuck on the toe? There you go. I think you're pushing through your toe, but you're not creating a rotation. Because for me to get this hip going that way, I have to it's shift my right? toe towards the launch monitor. So when you get here, it's hard for me to do so. Shove yeah, that one. That's when you see that foot doing that, because they push that way. <laughs> I want to see if I get that feeling. So it's just here. There you go. Good. Good. Right, so the key to that has to be it is a push out of that leg foot, not just snapping the leg back. Yeah. A sheer force. Yeah. Oops. It's oh, that was quite tough. Come on, baby. 17. Mm. That was closer. That felt good. It wasn't Padre Carrington. <laughs> what does he get up to now? Oh, 180 or something. Full speed winner. But he's, he's foot. It's over there. Yeah. Like he just jumped out of it. He's got so much. What was that one video with him and Shane Lowry where he bet him? Yeah. Kicked the 200 volt plate and he just got it. Mike Hill. <laughs> Recently? Yeah. Two, two months ago. Wow. 200. He's like, I'll throw my credit card down all week if he gets 200 or something like that. He's like, oh yeah. <laughs> 52 years old. <laughs> Trail twist. Lead push. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Are there any good training aids for that? That shear? Yeah. Right here? Yeah, this is actually really good. Yeah, this is what I was telling you about. This yeah. thing's awesome. So, I'll do this right handed. Yep. Do it. You want to see kind of in transition this thing? This way. So, as I take it to the top and come down, I want to twist it that way. So, it's push in and out. So basically, that's tip training me to push my lead foot towards the golf ball. Interesting. Dig it in, yeah. Resist it. Entry's got to get here. Can I do it this way? Yeah. Does it matter? No, it doesn't. This goes any way you want it to go. <laughs> oh, is it supposed to turn in the backswing? No, a little bit. Yeah, yeah, a little bit, and then really torques when you. There you go. There you go. Oh, interesting. See how it tips towards your toes quite a bit? There you go. Really twist it. There it is. Interesting. Oh, that's just wild. <laughs> Feeling in your core? Uh, I don't know where I feel that yet. Yeah, all right. <laughs> that was just a survival test. <laughs> yeah. it's, it's different. But check in tomorrow or the next day on what's sore. <laughs> yeah, right. But I realized like, I can go around. Oh, what a shot. Yeah, it's penetrating. Yeah, put this in the bag. Put the carry it around. 71 ball space. 171. Really good. On 117. Yeah, that was awesome. The pass, good. i tell you that. I mean, I've seen 117 with this big, this is a big driver. Uh, weighty, you mean? Heavy? Just, uh, you know, the, the bigger drivers don't, they're not as fast, right? Right. I think it's big. That was interesting. Gave me a good... This Even though I didn't do it very well, it definitely gave me a feel. <laughs> this makes my speed go up. I've got a bunch of these at school. Uh -huh. Oh, I can just order that. You send me that, Neil? Yeah. Okay, another cut. That's what do, That's right. I can have a minion. <laughs> okay, let me try that. Don't come up here. Oh, yeah. Oh, that felt like I was turning a million miles out. <laughs> 18. 118. Face a little bit. That was one. That was just a hair in the heel. I think. 0.02 yeah. smash difference, but those numbers aren't going to go too far off one. Yeah. That just felt like I was just turning yeah. really hard. Yeah. Really hard. Yeah. This could be yeah. useful on yeah. the 18th at New Orleans. We water on the right. Someone who's normally back here. 
Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Okay. Oh, that's killed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that's roasted. 72. 301 carry. Oh. 118, 301 carry. 172. That was awesome. Six smash. Good lord. <laughs> That'll play. Thanks.